is everywhere. It, it, it's in our iPhones. It's in our smartphones. It's also essentially just smart machines and code. And that's hard to regulate. Uh, its uses can be regulated, though. At a domestic policy level, we could say some places might be appropriate for some activities, but other places aren't. So take facial recognition, for example. Uh, we could say that this particular building or this zone, it's okay to use facial recognition, say, in an airport. But we could say, no, a church or a school, it's not appropriate. Um, some might say, well, that's hard to do. How do you come up with those rules? But we do the same thing with guns, or we do the same thing with cameras in my gym locker room. So it's possible. Internationally, regulating AI might be tricky. Uh, so we might start using the word governing. And we're at the very beginning of that process. And that's going to entail just trying to understand how different countries, different cultures approach what AI is, define what it is, what it does, and, and what the norms are. Uh, and some things will be hard, and some people will say, well, this is going to be too hard. But look, we've arrived at norms in the military space, uh, a set of norms that humans have come to agree to and respect over time.